happy Tuesday and today I want to talk about consistency and transformation this has been a journey that I've been on and I don't know how many times I call this this crazy journey that I went on because <laughs> I I'm still five and a half years later I'm still pinching myself that I even found such incredible opportunity to not only transform my life but to help others create similar breakthroughs and I was thinking back I'm sitting in a place this morning where I'm looking at this business that I've grown that five and a half years later when I started on my personal journey to getting unfat <laughs> um, there's no way I could have seen this as even a possibility in my future I couldn't even see that I would be at my high school weight living at a BMI that I haven't seen since high school or even maybe I don't even know that I ever reached this BMI in my life but waking up every day with just such joy and passion and zest for a living to be awake and alive and I just needed to get on here and share that what that transformation has done for me and to realize that when I embarked on this journey I go back to probably a time when I thought I felt really good in my life and it was about the time when I was turning 50 and although I was overweight I had a lot of things that were going well and I felt really happy and a lot of joy and then things started to happen. I lost my dad in that year and just a lot of things started happening with learning with my sister was sick and that her cancer was back and a lot of things entered into the picture and I think back to that time in my life and where I'm at now and I try to do like what happened in those last few eight years it will be I'm gonna be 59 and just another month so it'll be almost nine years and I'm thinking about what happened and how did I get here and it started so innocently as I was in a place where I didn't feel good in my clothing I had reached a size extra large moving into a 1x and on my small five foot two frame just didn't feel comfortable and I had never really struggled with obesity in that season of my life I had probably yo-yo dieted in and out of that 10 to 20 pounds but never really found myself in a place where I would have said I hit that place of obesity and I did by the time I was 53 because I was just not aware and I want to speak to that girl today who was 50 who was just kind of getting by and life was okay and if I could tell her to wake up to wake up you are not that far away from a completely different life if I could have told myself and believed that I was literally four months four months away from living a completely different life you see in 2015 I finally made a decision to do something and it took me that long to make a decision 
because I was so skeptical. I had tried so many things. I'd done a lot of starvation. I had done a lot of magic pills, <laughs> done a lot of different things. And although I could lose the weight, I wasn't finding the sustainable change, the sustainable. And as I started embarking on this journey and in a conversation with my coach, I was trying to figure out what makes this program different. And what she had shared with me was that she had been living for years, sustaining and optimizing her health. And I was like, well, that is what I'm looking for. I was looking for that in my own life. I was looking for getting to a healthier place, but I, I really didn't want to go back and forth anymore. I really wanted to know what was I doing and I knew there was a disconnect between what I was doing and the life I wanted. There was a disconnect. I just didn't know what it was. And I found a program that literally helped me lose 45 pounds between August and December of 2015. 45 pounds gone. Just like that. <laughs> It felt like that. It felt slow when I was going through it. And I had to keep reminding myself that it took me 53 years to put that uncomfortable weight on over time and to give myself grace that it was coming off as slow. Because once you make a decision, I'm going to tell you, it feels really slow. <laughs> but what I found is I found something that worked. And people were asking me what I was doing. And I still was skeptical that this could work for the long haul. I hadn't had that evidence happen to me yet. And I found something on this journey. This program works. I've been creating the evidence of how it works in the long run over the last five years since I reached my goal. And it has something to do with consistency over time. And so I embarked on this program. I embarked on a journey that I had no clue where it was going. All I knew was that people were having success and I wanted that too. And I didn't just want to lose the weight because I'd done that. I wanted the lifelong Part of this journey that people were offering and so when I work with people as a coach today I tell people there is an opportunity for those who want a diet to just lose the weight but I don't coach that I coach transformation is that what you want are you looking for changes that aren't just temporary, but that are lasting and that give you hope for a different future? You see, I embarked on this journey and I lost the weight, but what I gained in the process was tools, a supportive community, the help of a health coach, a transformational system that actually literally helps us change our mindset and our thinking and our habits and our behaviors. And then I, I stepped into it even further because part of the big picture of transformation is transferring the skills to another human. In the process of transferring the skills to another human, I not only learned it on a deeper level, but I gave myself a gift I didn't even know I wanted or needed. And it came in, it started as like paying it forward. I wanted to share what I got with other people. But this morning I'm looking at my business and I'm looking at this community and I'm looking at the organization that I've created and the lives that have been impacted and changed. Whether people are coming to us to get healthy in their body, to improve 
what they're already working on or if they want to get healthy in their finances or create options or margins, giving them margins. That is what happened on the accidental. And I found myself in a place where I'm living in a very different mindset of finances. And a lot of this comes with a lot of dialogue that goes on in my head. And it's the dialogue that, who the heck are you? And what do you think you're doing? Ugh, anyone go with me there, that we have something and it's work for us. And then there's that negative conversation in our head, like, who the heck are you? That thing that tells me I'm not worthy or I'm not enough or, and I'm pushing through all those fears right now. I'm so afraid of what other people might think that I have created opportunity and options in my own life, but not only in my life, but in the families that I'm helping create breakthrough in their own. And it's just like the weight loss piece of the program that I got to a healthy weight. It was consistency over time that got me to a healthy weight, but it's been the consistency over time for the last five and a half years that's got me healthier in my head, healthier in my heart, healthier in our finances, where I can share this so boldly because I know breakthrough happens in what we do consistently. And the evidence is in the fact that I am doing this and I'm walking alongside others who are also doing this. And the gifts that they're giving to their family, whether it's for Neil and I, it's time freedom. Being able to schedule my time around what matters most for our family. Because at our ages, that looks different than maybe when I was younger. And if I could speak to that younger person of myself and going, what would time freedom have meant for me as a young mom? raising my kiddos, not having to worry about punching a clock, but creating the income I needed to support my family and create a life with my kiddos at the same time and helping others get healthy. You see what happened to me on the way of this journey? I got healthy in my body got healthy in my mind. I got healthy in my spirit. I'm getting healthier in my finances in the point where I'm going to be able to bless abundantly. And that's something that is important to me in my life and what I want to create is being able to give abundantly. I have a big why that helps me wake up every day going, who do I need to share this with today? Who's looking to get healthy in their body? Who's looking to get healthy in their mind? Who is trapped? Who is struggling? Who is contending? Who could use the financial blessing right now in this season of flipping a year and a half of disarray? Unknown, uncertain. And by me sharing this gift, unashamed about offending somebody, but actually reaching through and grabbing who is that person that needs this gift today? There are so many lives that are being changed in so many incredible ways. And it all started because I started on a journey that I thought was just about a physical part of the journey. I didn't know that my headspace <laughs> was actually holding me back. I didn't understand that the consistency over time was going to help me rewire some thinking. I didn't 
understand that the consistency over time was actually going to help me break through in some freedom in my finances that allowed me to sell a business that allowed me to walk away from a full-time job that allowed me to walk away from a part-time job that I actually loved. I actually loved all the things I did, but they all took a lot of my time. Today, I'm blessing lives in crazy, abundant ways. And I don't know what aspect of this program is what you need, but I can tell you there is an aspect of this program that could bless your socks off, that could give you breakthrough, that could give you freedom in an area of your life for me, it came as time freedom. One of the biggest pays that I get has nothing to do with the money. But to actually see the lives that are being transformed or the impact that it's making as it ripples from a daughter to a sister to a parent to a, to a brother, to an aunt, to another aunt, to another aunt, maybe to an uncle, to a friend, to their friends and family, and to see that ripple, ripple, ripple in every conversation I have when one person gets started, the ripple that their health makes in their families in their lives. I heard a story this last week of a young lady who's 27 and has Down syndrome, whose aunt got on a journey and started teaching this 27 year old just healthier eating habits. this 27 year old young beautiful gal with down syndrome is creating healthier habits she's down like 20 pounds and she's dancing for healthy movement and she's learning healthy habits and the young lady that started this probably didn't even see her own 20 pounds was going to make that kind of impact. And you hear these stories and you hear them over and over and over. And it fills my heart with such joy because I started this journey so selfishly about my own health. But as I got to share it with other people, I got to see what the real gift is is when you give it away, which is tied to my very big dream in my life that I wanna give so generously and so abundantly. And you know the very best gift that I am giving away right now is breakthrough. Healthy body, healthy mind, healthy finance, healthy spirit, helping people find joy, healthy families, healthy parents, healthy grandparents. I look in my, my business this morning and I'm on my knees that I was led to this beautiful gift and this beautiful program that's literally not only changed my life for good, but it's changing so many other people's lives. And I have a big heart and a desire to serve humankind on a very different level and I found a vehicle 
that can help me bring that to people. I want to share it. I don't know what aspect you could use, but I do know there's a piece of this that could literally bless your socks off. Are you curious? Interested? It's not just about weight loss. It's about living an abundant life. And I believe everyone deserves to live that abundant life that God designed us to live. He wants us to have abundance in our life. And I am moving forward to help other people create that too. Want to join me? I'd love to have you join the party. It is so darn fun to see people's lives change so much. Looking for a life of abundance? <laughs> Let's talk. I have a solution and I can help.